Now true, we all need money. Simply because we've all agreed that we all need money. There's no other reason. It's important to understand this about money. A lot of people don't know it. Money is a measure of wealth. Money is not wealth. Money is like inches. Dollars, let's say, are like inches. They are a way of measuring real wealth, which consists of material resources plus energy plus intelligence. That's wealth. Money represents it. You see, a lot of people don't feel happy unless they have another thing beyond money, which is called status. And status, to a very large extent in our economy, consists in conspicuous consumption in having this thing and that thing and the other thing, in having a swimming pool, a uh, Ferrari, uh, a certain kind of clothes and uh, a certain kind of house with an enormous round style picture window and so on and so on and so on. And we think uh, we need all that. We have a whole world based on, on this. Two things. Save up. There's a good time coming. So put your, put your money aside, invest it. Secondly, which is, is somewhat contradictory, happiness consists in the possession of things. A lot of people, when they feel inadequate, bored, unfulfilled, try to get rid of this sensation by going shopping. A lot of people spend all their daytime shopping. That's the thing to do. You go out and shop and come back loaded with all kinds of things. But you can't live in six houses at once. You can't ride more than two horses at a time. You can't drive more than one car at a time. So we tend to become absolutely overloaded with possessions and have the greatest difficulty, therefore, in moving ourselves around. Because every time we move, we have to carry all the stuff with us. Uh, we, in other words, are absolutely cluttered with enormously heavy objects. And it, it, it doesn't redound to our true material comfort. They have to be taken care of. They have to be uh, cleaned. The moths have to be kept out of them. They're a perfect pest. But in a culture where you work and play is different, you work in order to make money to play. This is insane because you spend most of the time working. And then what you care, if all you carry, if you don't really value the work, I mean, you're lucky if you've got work that you really enjoy doing, but if you don't really value the work, all you get out of it is money. Then you come home with that and you're supposed to play. Well, you're pretty tired to begin with. And uh, we just don't play, that's all there is to it. You might play Saturday or something, uh, with the day off, but in the evening, uh, very few people actually play. They sit and passively watch television. And uh, they got all the money in the world. I mean, compared with Hindus and uh, Africans and so on, we live like princes. But we don't enjoy it. Not really. There's no gusto for it. You would think that people would come home and have orgies and banquets and uh, with all that money. <laughs> and they don't. <laughs> It's just uh, a sort of constant disappointment.